This is the part where you go slow. Cue music in the background. The soundtrack to this game is absolutely perfect. Seems like it was composed by a professional film composer. Now I'm gonna get the interview. Uh, wait, what's back here? Thanks for looking after my baby. Oh, that's just to lean against the uh, dresser. I just couldn't cope anymore. What kind of wallpaper does she have? Just not in Germany. Jeremy, is that her husband? Such a good boy. Oh no, Jeremy is Jeremy Bowles, the victim. Oh my god. Sit down on the bed. You this baby on your own. Doesn't Jeremy's father live with you anymore? He disappeared. The day after Jeremy. The day after Jeremy, yes. I don't know what happened to him. The gears in my head are turning and I'm getting thoughts. Remember Lauren. Lauren's husband disappeared right yes. after her son Johnny disappeared. Did your husband say anything before? And he she disappeared? thought that he just abandoned her Did because he, he was a drunk. No, or something. But this woman's no. husband disappeared right after her son disappeared I also. Without a word and there was just a cell phone. Cell phone, yes. A cell phone? So do yeah, you get what's happening? I found a cell phone in his dresser. I'm sure it wasn't his. I'd never seen it before. I tried to turn it on, but it didn't work. The fathers of all the victims Jesus. were sent a shoebox full of clues and like yeah. some kind of scavenger it's hunt more. involving like trials in order to possibly it. save their sons. And sure none of them have done it. Do you have any family or anybody to help you? But, um... Yeah. It's with, like, Lauren's yeah. husband and, uh, Mr. Bowles. And they both disappeared trying to save their friend. sons. And, uh, really the guy at the convenience home. store, like, just didn't That's even open the shoebox because he didn't realize it was related, maybe? Well, look after yourself. And, uh... Is that a statement from the developers about how Indians don't make good fathers? A little defamation to Asian culture from our friends in France. She mentioned the cell phone, so I assume I have to, um... can I interact with here? That's her suicide note. Is the baby okay? Yeah, exactly. I have to take the cell phone because that's a clue. Because that was, that showed up after her son disappeared because it's one of the items in the box. Because it was one of the items in Ethan's box as well. So now we have a Ethan trying to save his son, and Scott shall be investigating the disappearances, and he's starting to get on the trail of clues if he's perceptive. He's going to figure out that um, the father's disappeared trying to save their sons. And uh, he's probably going to like show up at uh, one of the uh, places that like Ethan has to go to, and they're going to run into each other. showing me scenes from inside the house like I'm forgetting something. I hope I didn't just like mess up the whole story by leaving so early. I'm sure of it. I'm sure that uh, that's really what's happening. The origami killer is either trying to get caught or he's trying to see which father can save his son.
adorable shop. Alex Grocery. It doesn't even say Alex's Grocery, it just says Alex Grocery. So this is where the note told him to go. The parking lot ticket in the Oregon Theater leads to this garage. What am I going to find here? can't stop thinking about that well. Sean's team is exhausted. But at least he's alive. I'll do anything to get him out of there. Give yourself a pep talk, you're going to need it. I have a feeling this isn't the ugliest that things are going to get for Ethan. Excuse me? Hey! Oh! Huh! Sorry! Good to see you. Uh, what can I do you for? I'd like to get my car. Side. Here, it's the third floor now. The service elevator is at the far end of the garage. Take the keys. Thanks. Ah, oh, you have yourself a good one, Chief. I wonder if the killer is acting alone or if he is an accomplice, because uh, it seems like a lot of work to uh, like leave a car in the garage for two years in anticipation of uh, sending Ethan to get it. Does he choose his victims like way in advance or does he just set up all of these um, things for future people, whoever they may be? Okay, so it's that one, all the way in the back, on the left. Probably not all the way, it's probably the one behind that uh, minivan, or truck, I guess behind the truck, yeah. It's a pretty nice car. Ethan just pulled something out of the driver's side console. That's like a GPS. Your destination is four miles from here. Leave the parking lot and take the first right. He's not going to call the police. He's going to follow this trail himself. very foggy today. It looks like he's falling asleep at the wheel. You have reached your destination. Oh no, he's parked. He stopped. Are you ready to show your courage in order to save your son? Show your courage. Listen carefully. Take the highway and drive against the traffic for five miles. If you haven't reached your destination in five minutes, you will have saved 
I have to drive five, ma five miles in five minutes in the wrong direction. Die? I don't want to die. Not here. Oh, these are just his thoughts. Like he doesn't want to die. If I succeed, I'll get more letters from there. It's my home we need. No turning back now. He said five, they said five minute time limit, so you, you have to just go. You can't keep thinking about it. I'd do anything to save my son. Let's go. Except. I've got to do it, for Sean's sake. I have no choice. We have to drive for five minutes in the wrong direction, and like we ran it out of the cars. Come on. This way. We did it, we missed them. Turn the controller, good. Right, this way. This way now, left. Damn, we got hit. We're spinning out. Alright, counteract the spin. You're supposed to turn your wheel, I think, in the opposite direction of the skid. If you lose traffic, lose traction. Get out of the way. Alright, just turn. It's gonna be okay. Oh no, come on. Right. R2. Is that break? No, he actually like, jumped over like a ramp on the back of a vehicle. This is insane. There's construction workers. We're missing them. We're doing good. Oh, two. No, no. I didn't dodge the hubcap. It doesn't matter. I'm still good. The vehicle's still stable. Now there's a toll booth. We have to drive through the toll booth in the wrong direction. Okay. We're staying near the edge. That car backed out. We just barely avoided a collision there. Away from the police. Just go further away. We're not going to ram him. R2! I broke. Hit the police car instead. This way. We lost the police. No, there's a whole barricade. Holy shit, they're fast at erecting that. L2! No! I missed two button presses in a row and I flew off the road. Car is on fire and I have to press the screen. Shake the control. L1. The prompts are upside down because the car is flipped. It's clever. Inside the GPS, yeah, okay. Up. Shake. I'm still holding all the other buttons. Alright, smash it. Pick up their key. Good. Open the glove compartment. L1, R1, R2. Up. Got it. It's a flash card. We get out of the car, dummy, before the gas tank blows. What the fuck? Alright. I don't want to die. There we go. We got the door open. I did pretty well, well on those button prompts. Those weren't as hard as the ones while driving. Oh my god. The last two while driving were like instantaneous. You had to just know what was coming. We crashed, but we still made it. Five.
have RAT. He's been sitting here this whole time and the police, um, after this long chase, haven't like followed the wreckage of the car over to the side of the road and discovered that he crawled out of it. This city does have some very incompetent officers. I was impressed at how rapidly they managed to erect like a three-car blockade to try to stop him when they realized he was driving the wrong way on the interstate. There was some very fast response time, but uh, maybe they all just threw their arms up in the air and said, screw this, I'm going home, as soon as uh, he drove through there. Now we have Mystery Girl again. I got a to trophy called Good Driver. I definitely did perform very good driving in that scene. But I'm glad that the game likes me, so I'll take the compliment. Thank <laughs> you. 